What's up, guys? This is the Comic Vine News for the week of March 15th, 2013. And we have a lot of stories uh, to talk about today. Um, tons of stuff that went up on the site that we're not going to talk about here, so you should definitely check out our news page in general just to get a good idea of what we uh, what we covered this week because there was a lot of news. First up, we had an interview with uh, writer slash artist of The Flash. Brian Bucciolato, and he talked a little bit about his upcoming project, Black Bat, for Dynamite Entertainment. So there's that. We also spoke to Scott Snyder this week, who talked a little bit about Batman Zero Year, which is going to explore the early years of Bruce Wayne. Writer Joshua Hale Fielkov is preparing to disassemble Ultimates Comics Ultimates. Uh, the writer is going to be taking over the Marvel Comics series, starting with issue number 25, which is out in June. So we've got a little little bit of a preview where, uh, where you can check out a quote from, uh, from Josh, which you can read to get a better idea of what he has prepared for this series. It looks pretty crazy. We had an exclusive look at Dynamite Entertainment's June 2013 books, solicits, covers, crazy stuff, lots and lots and lots of books out for Dynamite in June. And um, in addition to those, we also had uh, J. Michael Straczynski's uh, launch of Joe Comics, so you should check that out. That was exclusive to us, but I think it went wide yesterday as well. Um, we got a preview for Hawkeye number nine. Um, we saw Age of Ultron number five, and we had an exclusive preview uh, today, actually Friday, uh, for Red Hood number 18. Red Hood and the Outlaws number 18. So be sure to look at that. Um, we had some movie news as well. We got the trailer for Kick-Ass 2 and also a look at a G.I. Joe Retaliation Ninja clip, which is pretty cool. We had two Off Their Minds videos go up this week. So Tony caught up with a couple of creators, um, including Brian Bucciolato, James Robinson, and um, Sam Humphreys, and he asked them what Marvel and DC characters would make good amalgams, as well as another video which went up on Monday where he asked what comic book, whether or not comic book deaths should remain permanent. So you can check those out and, and check out the opinions of the of comic creators and what they think about uh, both of those topics. And I reviewed some cool Archie Comics inspired makeup by Mac. And if you really are interested in that, you can watch the video. And uh, Matt wrote about why you should read, if you haven't read it yet, why you absolutely need to read Why the Last Man. Uh, today we should be seeing a brand new episode of the Comic Vine podcast, so look for that on our podcast page or subscribe to it on iTunes. And I guess that's it for me. Don't forget, next Wednesday, of course, every Wednesday, Tony does his podcast. Matt was actually the special guest on this week's podcast, so you should listen to that if you haven't already. Um, and I guess that's all, right? Yeah, totally. We're done. We're done here. Um, don't forget to have a safe weekend because it's St. Patrick's Day weekend, so no drinking and driving. That does it for me. Have an awesome weekend, and you guys can catch me next Friday.